Amber and today I'm going to show you how you can use straws to learn column method addition. I'm going to start by adding together 62 and 26. We can use straws to make our two numbers with bundles of 10 straws to represent the 10s and individual straws to represent the 1s. I've drawn a baseboard which I've split into 10s and 1s. For 62, I'm going to need six bundles of ten straws and two ones. Underneath, I'm going to place my straws for the second number, which is 26. For this, I'm going to need two tens and six ones. We are now going to add the two numbers together. When you do column addition, you always add the ones first and then the tens. If I add together the two and the six individual straws, we now have eight straws in the ones column. If I do the same with the bundles of ten straws, Six tens and two tens make eight tens. So 62 add 26 equals 88. We can show this on a whiteboard without the straws. This is showing 62 add 26 written as column method. Next, we're going to see what happens when the two numbers added together in the ones column are greater than 9. We're going to add together 56 and 38. For 56 we need 5 bundles of 10 straws and 6 individual straws. And for 38 we need 3 bundles of 10 straws and 8 individual straws. We're going to do exactly the same as last time and add together the 1s first and then the 10s. If I add together the 1s, 6 straws and 8 straws equals 14 straws. We can't have 14 straws in the 1s column so I have to exchange 10 of my 1s for a, a 10 bundle. And I'm going to have to place it in the tens column. Now the ten is underneath the answer box, I can move my four ones into the answer box. We can now add up the tens, but I also need to remember to add, a, add on the ten I carried from the ones column. nine tens which is 90 and four ones so 56 add 38 equals 94 we can show this as column method without the straws why don't you pause the video and have a go at some yourself I'm going to give you the answers in three two one for 42 we have four tens and two ones and for 27, we have two tens and seven ones. We add together the ones first, so two add seven equals nine, and then the tens, so four add two equals six, which is 60. So in total, we have 69. We can see this as written method without the straws. So 42 add 27 equals 69. For 36, we have three tens and six ones. And for 26, we have two tens and six ones. We add together the ones first, but this time six and six comes to 12. So we have to exchange 10 ones for a 10 and carry it to the tens column. We then add three tens, the two tens and the one which has been carried 
So we have six tens all together. We can see this is written method without straws. So 36 add 26 equals 62. For 47 we have four tens and seven ones. And for 39 we have three tens and nine ones. We add together the ones first. This time 7 add 9 comes to 16. So we have to exchange 10 ones for a 10 and carry it to the tens column. We then add the 4 tens and the 3 tens and the 1 which has been carried. So we have 8 tens all together. We can see this is a written method without the straws. So 47 add 39 equals 86. I hope you all found that useful. If you did, please like my video and subscribe to my channel. I'll be uploading a video with something new every week. See you all soon. Bye!